Alright guys, so this is going to be a quick downgrade tutorial for Xenoverse 2. First, you're going to press Windows R, you're going to type Steam Open Console. I'll put this command in the description so you guys can just copy and paste. You're going to click OK. This will open up the hidden Steam Console. Next, we're going to need to go to Steam DB. You're just going to type it in right here, Steam DB. Hit the first one that pops up. And then you just want to find Xenoverse 2. Once you click it, you want to go down to Depot right here this is the current build so you want to go here and you'll see this the green one is always the most current one and the red one is the one we we're previously on so i believe the current update we're on right now is 1.2402 so this should be 1.24 base or 01 so we want to go back a couple i'll go back to like march so you know up here by the dates of uh, when the release came out so I'm at 1.23. So we'll try to find a March release. So here we go. See, this should be 1.2302, I believe, or 03. So we'll go ahead and download this one. So we need this number right here, which is the build ID or the manifest ID, I mean. So now we're gonna go back to the console and we need to copy this command, paste it in. I'll put this in the description as well. This download depot. So you want to go back to Steam and you want to do Control V and you want to click Space. And now we want to copy and paste this manifest ID number right there. Once we do that, we're just going to go ahead and do Control V again and it's going to go ahead and download. So this will take a little bit, it doesn't have an indicator but it is downloading and after it's done it'll tell you that it's done and then we'll go ahead and continue from there one eternity later all right so now that it's downloaded we're going to go to the default steam directory which is going to look at this c we're going to files 86 we're going to go to steam we're going to go to steam apps we're going to go to usually we go to common but this time you want to go to content that's what it's going to be and you're going to go to app and you go to depot and then everything's going to be right here okay you're just gonna copy all of this and then you're gonna paste it in your usual directory. For me, that's in my D drive because I install my games in my D drive. So Steam Apps, like usual, then you go common. Got my Universe 2, which is your usual directory. And then basically you're just gonna go ahead and delete everything that you got in here. Okay? And then you're just gonna go ahead and paste in all the new stuff you downloaded. Okay? Which is basically version 1.23 of the game okay side note if you want to hop between different versions of the game just back it up so you only have to do this process once so right here you see I've already got xv2 version 1.2303 and I've got xv2 version 1.2402 which is the most current version in my uh, folder up here xv2 versions so usually I keep the most recent version and the moddable version of the game in one folder and then I also save my backups or I mean save my save files in a backup folder so that way I have one for 1.23 and 1.1.24 um, as far as the saves go 1.23 1.24 the save files don't work on different versions so you need to have a save file for each one basically when you update it automatically, your 1.23 save will turn into a 1.24 save. So that's how you get the 1.24 save and the 1.23 save so that they're the same. But you can't go, you see what I'm saying though, you can't go backwards basically. Uh, okay, so now we're just going to go ahead and let this continue to transfer. Once it's finished transferring, we'll go ahead and boot up the game. Alright, so as you guys can see, we're now in version 1.2303 of Xenoverse 2. So, that's pretty much how you downgrade. It's pretty straightforward. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the tour. So, appreciate y'all boys, man, for real. 
showing a lot of love, man. Especially everybody that's been in the Discord, man. I really appreciate y'all guys, man. Like, for real, man. Really means a lot. Uh, we got new socials now for the page. All that. So, y'all go follow me over there. That's pretty much it for the tutorial. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.